Oh, by God, I... You seem only a... I, I could... M it may be we can help you. And you shall have it. My father... It, you say... Oh, oh, it, oh, but when I'm... God, oh, I, 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 I'll... From good God, I... That Do you see? Guide me. <laughs> See Hunwald's back, drinking and jabbering as always. Hunwald. So this is Hunwald's safe haven. Though we be a mercy in Shire today. To... Hunwald, who is this stranger? Eivor. Come, sit. Bread and ale, please, alewife. I have been discussing my delicate situation with Aldgar here. Lord. He is a nobleman like me, one of Lincolnshire's sturdy thanes. Hunvald's idea of sturdy is a mug of ale that won't tip over. Alvgar has pledged his loyalty to my family, the House of the Ferocious Swan. With his influence and your might, we shall rid Lincolnshire of the ruffians who plague this land, once and for all. We are going to see your father, Hunvald, that's all. Indeed, Eivor, with speed and purpose. You are the axle to my wheel, the spark to my tinder. Hunbald, I don't know your friend here, and not knowing him, I don't trust him. I'm his voice of reason, Eivor. And I've told him a thousand times it's too dangerous for him in Lincolnshire. Listen, I've come to escort you to your father's side. We go now, or I walk. Ah, yes, to Lincoln! Away! But with care. The road between here and there is teeming with brigands who wish me dead. You daft lump of lard! A single dame will not protect you against the whole of Mercia's army. 
I think you're wrong, Alvgar. And here he'll prove it. I'm hot for a fight, Snowdog. Give me half a chance, I'll stove your heathen face right in! Alright, a quick brawl to get familiar with the local dregs. welcomes us more into the day than a swift cruising. Is this what it means to be your friend? See. Shut your hinge, Chill, and stop dripping blood in my hall. I told Hunwald to stay near. Where did he wander off to? Sounded like Hunvold. He went out that side door. Ah! Hunvold is in trouble. Leave him be. Jesus! He's brought a bloody dame! Oh, I have been struck down. Within an inch of my life. The silver is Are you hurt? Unbelievable! The Battle of Bottlestun will be remembered for years to come! Algar, we have won our first great victory! Humboldt, are you hurt? Never better! We should get to Lincoln. Yet, yeah. what horrible souls are hunting me? Me, the son of a beloved elderman. Was it naive to believe my status as a nobleman held some sway over... Here. What cause have any to dishonor me? Look! Boats there! We could sail the waters to Lincoln, sink the... What were you told when the guards exiled you? Oh, scraps of nonsense. I woke to screaming. A man grabbed me, said I was an immediate danger to my father. Ha! Horse pucky! Mercian soldiers then shackled me, rode me blindfolded to the River Wash, and told me plainly, start anew elsewhere, or face death in Lincolnshire. What did they mean? Oh, some nonsense about me praying for his... Oh, some nonsense about me praying for his death. Hungry for his inheritance. Speak plainly, Humboldt. I can't help you if I don't know the full story. You hold no grudge against your father? No, never! No, I suspect the order for my exile came from on high. Here's the city of my birth, my present sorrows. No escape! 
Dragon guards everywhere. Follow me. Right behind you, Shadow Walker. My heart beats like the drums of your dragon lord. This town was your home? It was, and should still be. Oh, to see it now fills my eyes with tears. Save weeping for prayers. We're not inside yet. One day I won't have to skulk around this town. Oh, how can a place I once called home look so alien to me now? So hard. One day I won't have to skulk around this town with my face hidden. I will walk proudly among the people I love. Oh, how can a place I once called home look so alien to me now? So harsh and unwanting. I Fear not. I shall make you mine again. you live I do my dear Reagan hair body and soul tell my father his son has returned and in fighting form it is urgent I speak with him I'm sorry Lord but your father has been taken taken when weeks ago Lord and well ill he was when they carried him off I wish I could say more Who took the Elderman? Was it soldiers or men of God? There were men with swords, and those of the cloth. And a healer, too. One who had oft been a guest in this house. Galwina. One of the sisters my father put great faith in. He still has friends in Lincoln. That's a good sign. Bishop Herivrith among them. He's kept a vigil at the town hall, looking after things in your father's absence until he returns. Will we find trouble there? At the town hall? You mean soldiers and the like? Aye. There have been many, many more about since your father took his leave. Right. We'll find a quiet way in if we can. <laughs> 